2-0. Oh, Mitrovic. 2-0. Game over. Hi guys, so on the way to Jerry Splish 3 um, match day vlog against Fulham. Now it's going to be a tricky game. Obviously, Fulham probably one of the best teams in the championship attacking me anyway. The likes of Mitrovic. I think Bobby Reed could possibly be out tonight. I've been reading. Uh, he's got a hamstring injury, but they've still got some great players. And for Knockout, is a doubt as well, which if he's out, that'll be a great bonus but for us. But like I said in my match preview, they're a very difficult side. Prediction 3 1 Fulham, unfortunately. I think they're going to have too much for us attacking the and we've been very poor recently. If you haven't watched my match preview, go and watch it because it's been an interesting few changes I'd make. If you haven't watched my match preview vlog against Huddersfield, please go and watch it. It's not doing as well as like, but obviously I, I do upload it a day later and it win the best of games, so go and watch it if you haven't already. But it's going to be good going down Liberty tonight. It's a cold one, but it's quite a sunny day, which is always a bonus. Um, let's hope we can get a win. We haven't won in, we haven't won in a while, actually. Um, don't think we've won since when was our last win I can't even remember our last win so bad it's good I think it was Wigan which is in the 2nd November so bless it in November with a win hopefully um, like I said it'd be good to get some predictions in so hopefully you enjoy this match today vlog if you do leave a like comment subscribe close and on 1,600 subscribers thank you to everyone for donating and so close to £200 and make sure you donate if you can, can. but for now guys I'll see you later come on Swan Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Unknown brain. Marvin Divine. Uh, I'm saying bye to all the lies and all the times you cried, saying that I wasn't right, that I was right by your side, you manipulator. Today, Williams, go back to me. Hello. Well, if Nathan Dye was signed today, it'd be 3 2 small. It'd be a 7 0 win there. Yeah, I know, but he's not playing, so it's going to be 2 1 loss. Uh, Goal scorers for Fulham, Joshua, Noma, and Alexander Mitrovic, and for us, Patterson. Thank you. Thanks for the donation, by the way. The True Jack, score prediction. 2 1 Fulham prediction. Our oh, score, sorry. I reckon Mitrovic has scored twice for Fulham, and I reckon RU for Swansea. Right, cheers. Uh, with Giant, not so, not so little, Jake Braley, score prediction. 3 0 to Fulham. Oh, Call Mitrovic, Kenny, and Cavalier. Thank you. With Luke Walker, score yeah. prediction. Uh, no, I'm quite negative today, 2 1 loss. Scorers. Uh, I think Mitch and Cavalier will score for Fulham. Swans. Marley. Um, what's his name? What's it called? I forgot. SCFC Vlogger. Uh, prediction. Uh, I'm going to go to World Tour. Scorers. Sarage. Sarage and Peterson for Swans. And then Mitrovic and my favourite Fulham player in predictions, Norgard, to score from the bench. Sound line up for the Swans. Freddie Wood, run, uh, Connor Robson, Norton, fullbacks. Van der Hoen, who's fit, and Wilmot. Grimes, Fulton, and Byers in midfield. And, uh, and the front three is Peterson, who starts again, AU and Sarage. Luke, what's the bench? I've got North Belkavan, as well, Carol, Selena, Mackay. Do you like that team? Yeah, I like it. I like the way Big Will's been dropped. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're not really making changes. I think maybe we'll just have to sell it to the last night. So, if we can get the win. <laughs> Let's see if Rolls can beat his man. Go on, Connor. Go on, you. Go on. Go on. Robert. Go on. Hey you! Yes! Yo! What a save to tonight, like Peterson! Oh no! Come on, keep it! Great cross, I think it was like Come on. And good cross! A good shot, a good save. And then more than that shot. And then we see if they've got a corner. Mikey Van der Hoek! It's a set piece more rubbish. A set piece is. Grimes. Oh. Yeah, so good. Oh, Come on, Peterson! Oh, oh, just over. Good tackle on me to get the chance for all over for him at the moment. The bar. Oh, of course. Mitrovic 1 0. <laughs> Crap defending. Surridge. Yes, Byers. Oh, corner. We have been poor again this half. So negative. We've got a corner. We win the Surridge. My word. Peterson with a mistake. 2 0. Oh, Mitrovic. 2 0, game over. Rubbish. Rubbish. Oh, 
half-time thoughts good? Well, um, to your view, uh, we started great, um, played decent football, but it's some mistakes. We need to sort out our mistakes. But at the same time, I'm hopeful it's getting frustrating you now. Well, we've been playing all right, it's, uh, but we need to sort the mistakes out seriously. But um, hopefully now, um, we could get a comeback, but I doubt I've seen it happening. Marley? Can't leave Metro Vets free for a start. Uh, Matthew Bent off the crossbar, obviously. Uh, we just let Metro Vets stand up for seven goals. I'm very unlucky, really. We attacked the choice, we haven't been that bad. I still dislike Brent. I'm sorry, he's not wealthy as a captain. But uh, I, I just said, I I to him. It's just too aggressive stuff. It's really messing the centre half there. Coming up for the second half now, and it feels like torture. <laughs> gonna have to watch the swans. Come on now, if we can get a goal, we could be back in this game. Like Peterson, it's a nice delivery. Byers, if Ashcroft's not going in, just not going to go in for us. Oh, it's incredibly frustrating. Oh, 3 0. Here we go. In a box. Oh, that's our 3 0. Good. Barry McKay. Chance for AU. Give it! Come on! Byers! Oh, wonderful! I'll give you £5 if it hits the wall. Because it's obviously going to hit the wall. Barry McKay. The man who has not played since about September. McKay. Way! Course. Yes! Yes! There's one back! There's one back! Come on! There's one back, George Pies the header, the Kai cross, two on down, there's you, and see, oh no, you resist me. Great cross, good header, half an hour, with 25 minutes less, left. You can get a point on this, it'll be brilliant. So, drop and go hard on. Come on, it's going to be one of the last chances of the game, are you? Go on, are you? Five minutes to turn on. Come on, Mackay! Oh! Come on, Red! I think my hair is going to turn grey the next time I see Swansea City win. Swansea City won, Fulham 2. Another loss for the Swans. Again, another poor performance. Second half was a much better performance, fair play. But the first ten minutes of the second half wasn't the best, but um, when Barry Mackay came on, I thought he made a very good impact, got the assist for the goal, of course. Um, but again, very poor performance from the Swans. Uh, it's becoming a bit of a very frustrating. Cooper, he's getting a bit under pressure now. Some fans start to really question him and see what he's about. Does he doesn't really have a plan B, according to some fans? But it's getting very, very frustrating. And I must say that myself. Um, again, um, two slot mistakes, two goals. Wilmot again had a stinker. Peterson at fault for the second goal is just and you can't give a team like Fulham that time on the ball and when. Clinical goal scorers like Alexander Mitrovic in the box, he's not going to miss. Um, defensively, we were a bit woeful today. Connor Ott, and before I finish, Connor Roberts, Boabas, and Andre, you sort your as you do, it absolutely stinks. There'll be a clip on the screen now of them all walking off the pitch. Disgraceful. The fans pay hard earned money. All right, it's a, it's, a co it's a cold day, it's a hard earned money, and you're walking off the pitch, and especially Connor Roberts, supposed to be a Swansea boy. Fix up corner, mate, because I know you're probably not watching, but I don't really care, mate. Your attitude absolutely stinks. You've been crap this season. Fix up or just leave. Because at the end of the day, we're not going to miss you because we've got Kyle Norton and we've got some better players than you, Frank. So fix up your attitude or leave. Simple as that. Goes to Andre you and Boa Baston as well because their attitude stinks as well. But on a more positive note, a bit of a rant there. But Sam Sturridge made a very good impact today, but I don't understand. We need to go. He takes Sam Sturridge off and brings Boa on. Like, we've got to play two up front, move Graham's full back, but. Um, again, poor performance, buys with a goal, but um, I just really don't know, it's becoming a joke to be honest, something's got to change soon and if it doesn't then it's going to be in a very hard winter now, it's going to be a quick turnaround of games now, next game is against West Bromwich Albion, probably the toughest game this season, but away from one we're a very bit different team, we've got to improve, I'll be going and we better have a better performance than we did today. It's not on and some of the players really have to sort their attitudes out because at the end of the day it is disgusting. We pay hard in money, throw tickets, throw season tickets and to follow away from them. If you don't even have the decency to clap off the pitch, not even a little clap, then you need to get your head out your own ass. Alright? Thanks for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Not good enough.